There was an old abandoned asylum, deep in the forest, known as Ravenswood Asylum. The asylum had a dark history, with tales of abuse, experimentation, and neglect of the patients. The local villagers avoided the place, believing it to be cursed. One day, a group of friends, who were fascinated by the paranormal, decided to explore the asylum. They were excited to discover the secrets that it held, and they were determined to find out the truth behind the rumors of the asylum. As soon as they entered the asylum, they felt an eerie presence, and they could hear the screams of the patients echoing through the halls. They soon discovered that the asylum was indeed haunted by the spirits of the patients who had suffered and died there. The friends were horrified to learn that the patients had been subjected to cruel experiments and treatments by the asylum staff in the name of science. The patient spirits were trapped in the asylum, unable to move on, due to the trauma they had suffered. The friends knew that they had to help the spirits move on, and they set out to uncover the truth about what had happened in the asylum. They found old records and documents that revealed the extent of the abuse and neglect that the patients had suffered. As they delved deeper into the asylum's history, the spirits became more aggressive, and the friends started to experience terrifying hallucinations and visions. They realized that the spirits were not only seeking revenge, but also trying to stop them from uncovering the truth. The friends were at a loss, and they didn't know what to do, they were trapped in the asylum and the spirits were becoming more and more aggressive. They knew that they had to leave the asylum and tell the world what had happened there. They managed to escape the asylum, but the spirits followed them. They started to haunt them, tormenting them with visions of their past suffering. The friends knew that they had to put the spirits to rest and free them from their torment. With the help of a psychic, they were able to perform a ritual that would put the spirits to rest. The friends were finally able to move on with their lives, but they knew that the spirits of Ravenswood Asylum would always be with them, a haunting reminder of the atrocities that had taken place there. The friends, still haunted by the spirits, decided to take action. They went public with their story, telling the world about the horrors that had taken place at Ravenswood Asylum. They shared the evidence they had found, and the public was outraged. The government, under pressure from the public, decided to launch an investigation into the asylum's past. The investigation revealed the extent of the abuse, neglect, and experimentation that the patients had suffered. The staff and doctors involved in the atrocities were brought to justice, and the asylum was shut down permanently. The spirits of the patients were finally able to rest in peace, knowing that their suffering had been acknowledged and that justice had been served. The friends were hailed as heroes, for their bravery in uncovering the truth and bringing closure to the spirits of Ravenswood Asylum. The asylum was left abandoned, a haunting reminder of the past. But the villagers, who had once avoided the place, now visited it as a place of pilgrimage and remembrance. They left flowers and candles to honor the spirits of the patients who had suffered there. The friends, still haunted by their experiences, decided to dedicate their lives to helping other spirits find peace and closure. They became paranormal investigators, helping other spirits move on and find rest. They knew that the spirits of Ravenswood Asylum would always be with them, but they were at peace with it knowing that they had helped to bring closure to the spirits and to the past. If you like this video, please give it a like and share. Subscribe the channel for more amazing stories.